So we've decided that we want to plant two raised beds, one for flowers and one for tomatoes. Um, so these are blueberry bushes right now. And we're thinking of moving, actually no, we're gonna put them over on this side between the blueberries and the muscadine vines. We're gonna put two raised flower beds right there. One for, for flowers so that our daughter can pick them and we can sell them with this sign at uh, the end of our driveway saying flowers for sale. And then the second one is for tomatoes that our friends from Homes Grown um, started in their greenhouse. Where, where are the tomatoes from again? I uh, ordered them off hossgrow.com. I uh, ordered indigo blueberry tomatoes. They're like a little cherry tomato. I don't know how they're going to be, but they look pretty good. And I ordered some Jubilee tomatoes. They're like a sandwich size that you can slice up and put them on bread. But they're, they're like an orangish yellow color. So we're going to try those out in the raised bed. See we're going to go down to the sawmill and get our wood. Yeah, just cut some cedar the other day. So it's already ready to go. Just got to screw it together and put it where we want it. So this is the, the cedar. If y'all could smell it right now, it smells amazing. But this is five by eight. And we're going to screw them in and make a rectangle, AKA flower bed. So we found some old weed barrier that we're gonna put down in the bottom first before we find the dirt and put dirt. And to our luck, it's looking like it's the perfect size that we have left. So this means it's gonna be a good project, right guys? Amen. Before we put in the dirt, we're gonna sprinkle in some ant killer just so we don't hopefully have any of those. Put some around the edge, you know how like they like to build a little mound on the edge and stuff. And while I've got it out, he's just gonna go ahead and mix some of that with his blueberries too, just so we don't have any of those fire ants on the blueberries. <laughs> Alright, now I'm gonna get the wheelbarrow and the shovel and go to town, I reckon. All right, we finally got all the dirt in there. 10 wheelbarrow loads full. Now we're just spreading it out and about to plant some, some seeds. I'm spreading it out. All right, we got the seeds planted. Now we're gonna put a little water on there and let them grow. Make another video when they start coming up. 